What is up everybody, my name is Armoxy and welcome back to another video on my channel. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what edit styles I picked for each and every agent and why I did so. Uh, this video idea was actually recommended to me by a moderator on my server by the name of Enter Name here. And if you want to uh, give me video ideas or just join my Discord server, I will link it in the description down below. So feel free to join, we have some awesome people in there and some very fun roles. But with that being said guys, let's jump straight into the video. Alright, so if you guys are unaware of the current season of Fortnite, I will just briefly explain it for you. So basically there's this team called Ghost and this team called Shadow and they're fighting each other. And in the battle pass you could complete a certain amount of challenges and you could unlock either a Ghost style or a Shadow style, but you have to pick which side you want to be on. And once you've picked your edit style, you cannot reverse this. You will have this edit style forever and you cannot get the other one. So therefore you have to pick very carefully which uh, team you want to be on. Let's take an example here. Uh, when you completed 18 of the Brutus briefing challenges, you would basically get the option to assign yourself a mission uh, because you did have to complete a mission in order to unlock the edit style. So when you assign yourself the mission, you will get a challenge to do and you do that challenge and then you will unlock the edit style. So that's pretty much how you unlocked the edit style. But now let's talk about what edit styles that I chose and why I chose them. So starting off with Brutus, I went with the shadow edit style. And this is the best edit style for him because the ghost style just looks like a knockoff stormtrooper that ate a little bit too much McDonald's. Um, I do not like the ghost version of Brutus. It's very lame and it's kind of lazy. And however, the shadow one looked very, very appealing to me and therefore I chose it. The back bling is very dope as well. This is just the best style for him in my opinion. But moving on to TNT now, I have to go with the ghost edit style. Uh, this edit style just looked so clean with her and the back bling turned into a white purplish color which I really loved and therefore I just had to go with the ghost version for TNT now. The shadow version is cool, not gonna lie, but the ghost one just, it just looked better in my opinion and therefore I just had to go with that. But if you guys know me, you are well aware that I never use female skins. Uh, but I just felt like I had to go with an edit style for Teen Tina as well, just to represent kind of, the back bling is pretty cool, but the skin itself, like the overall look of the skin, not a big fan, but the edit style is the best one out of the two, but yeah. But moving on to the Meowsul's skin, the Meowsul skin is a very creative skin and a cool concept, and I do like how it turned out, but I had to go with the ghost edit style for Meowsul's, I love the golden eyes, they look like stars, and I love the blue jeans. The backlink was pretty cool as well. It's a very unique color scheme, uh, the black and red one. We have too many black and red color schemes in the game, so I just had to go with something different this time. But overall, Meowsul's ghost style very clean, and I'm glad I chose it. But moving on to Sky, I went with the ghost edit style because I just loved the green and brown color scheme. And I love the way that Ollie turned green and her pickaxes and her back bling. So overall, the ghost one is better in my opinion because the shadow one is a black and purple color scheme. And there's just so many black and purple color schemes in this game. And I know the majority of people went with that edit style and I wanted to stick out a little bit. So I chose the ghost one. But we have now reached the final skin the Midas skin. Now, this skin is a very dope skin, actually. I do use it from time to time. Not often, but I use it sometimes with the fully golden one. Uh, but the styles for this guy was the shadow one is a black and gold, and the ghost one a white and gold. And I know so many people went with the black and gold, but I just could not. I had to go with the clean, basic white and gold. Just looks so amazing in my opinion. Uh, way better than the black and gold one. The black and gold one is just too basic. I know that everyone shows that. However, the back bling was pretty cool, the black and gold one. But again, the white and gold one is pretty cool as well, so not complaining there. But yeah, that's pretty much what skins I chose. 
And if you have any, you know, different edit styles that you chose for the skins, I would love to hear them in the comment section down below. But with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.